Hello everybody, this is Bait and right now we are in the woods. I haven't had many videos up because I've been busy just uh, foraging and gathering berries and mushrooms and the like. Also a couple nuts here and there, hazelnuts mostly. And we're getting ready for hunting season. And I've been getting some jams made up and preserving some other things. So I decided, well, why not make a video of me out in the woods then? And right now we're just checking out our hunting site for any evidence of moose. We do get a lot of moose up this way. We have two dogs with us today. One is the little one. We're trying to get her to be a little bit better at tracking and hunting and stuff. <laughs> She's a cute one. And Sage, who is somewhere, took off. <laughs> ah, there she is, right there coming. Coming to the whistle, like a good girl. Oh, she is fast. <laughs> no. Hey. And of course she goes straight for the salt. That's a good girl, Sage. Yeah? Oh, you smell something? Smell moose? Go get the moose. <laughs> no, don't get the moose. Moose are very dangerous creatures. You get a lot of forms up through here sometimes. Okay, now we're coming up on our blind. This is where we'll be spending our time doing our hunting. We set it up a while ago and set it here so that the animals can get used to it being here. We have, uh, as you can see, some shooting holes. Take a look inside. That's where the door is on that side. This is so that we uh, get some air in there. And I'm looking at it looks kind of like a track almost. We do get some tracks up here. It's kind of small. Uh, let me just take a good look around. Yeah, some track. That's exactly what I'm looking at. It's probably hard to see on the camera. And here we come to an opening here where the dogs like to run down and do a little swimming. As you can see, Sage is in the water. Tiger was in there with her, but she jumped on out. And Tiger's coming for the whistle somewhere. Looks like she's having a little tough time getting down. There she goes. Into the water. He's my loving husband. <laughs> And she shook on him. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice place to take a little break. Make sure you enjoy this swimming. Oh! <laughs> she doesn't like yeah. being in deep water for too long. I think she gets worried. Because she can't touch the bottom. We 
do get uh, all the bears around here. We, if you come over this way, if we come over this way, I should say. Oh, here comes Tigra. One by. Hope she doesn't go and start rolling in it. We got some bear scat here. It's a bit old. It was here two weeks ago. It's kind of a little bit smushed now, but yeah, that's what that is. Oh. They're going down that path. They're pretty quick, I must say. Oh! Oh! Guys, gonna knock me over if you're not careful. I like to go all out for speed, I must say. And oh, there's my husband down that way. They're back in the water. I went and gathered a lot of um, golden wood not too too long ago, and I dried it out and. Well, first I cleaned it, then I dried it out, and um, went and took all the flowers and everything off, and uh, put them in some tea bags and for some golden wild tea. Got some cattails down that way. Those are also good. Eat them all where, um, all year round. So that's some other things that we've been doing. We haven't had too many pin cherries this year though. As you can see this little one here doesn't even have any berries on it. And when we have found berries on them there's only been like a dozen most. So we didn't get any of those collected. Got paths off through the woods. A lot of people hunt around here, take their snowmobiles or their four-wheelers through the woods. So there's plenty of paths. It's pretty easy to go off path too. You just, you know, take a direction and go off into the woods. And there goes the dogs down through that way. Get a lot of raspberries around here. As you can see, here's just on the small plant right here. There's raspberries. The bears eat a, a lot of them. Came up here one day, there was a lot. Next day, almost nothing. Well, see you in a little bit again. Well, we're heading back. Didn't really pick up too much stuff. We just basically wanted to get the dogs out for a good one. It's been kind of restless. And if we happened to collect anything along the way, that was that would be a bonus. Did grab a couple of these little morsels, clovers. They taste really good, you know, you just grab them. Check them though, make sure there's no bugs or anything in them. Uh, this one still has dew on it, which is really a nice bonus. You just pop in your mouth. Mmm, tastes delicious. And we're always on the look for mushrooms also. And it could be pretty hard to identify mushrooms, so if you're not used to it or if you don't have a book or anything to help you out, I advise to not really gather and eat them. She's just sitting there. She's probably thinking, we're supposed to go up this way, Daddy. Why aren't you coming? Look at her. <laughs> Wonder if she smells or hears something. The dogs are pretty good at tracking oh. um, partridge. Yep, they sure do like grouse. <laughs> and here they come. <laughs> Back to the water, probably. Don't hear the splash. Ah, oh, they're just messing around with each other. Sage, don't be so hard on the little ones. You know she'll learn. <laughs> Come on, we're heading back. Back to the truck.
Hey. You managed to get, um, let's see, bit. I said easy, Sage. Yeah, see that? You chew your stick, huh? You chew that stick like it's nobody's business. Uh, we got a lot of blueberries. Oh, we froze those. Well, most of them. Um, we got some bunch berries, um, snowberries, raspberries. I think that's all the berries we cooked it this year. Yeah. Yeah. We need to go get some cranberries soon. Yeah, we're gonna grab some cranberries. Um, that'll be pretty much ready next month yeah. to be picking. First month. And um, still wanna get some winter green. Just for the winter. Yeah. Although snowberries is a type of winter green, it's in the, its family. <laughs> and we got the hazelnuts, um, shaga mushrooms. Mm, we did have dandelion, but we ate all that. <laughs> well, we got a lot of things. There's still a lot out there that we can get though. <laughs> Time of the gathering is not over yet, is it? No. But it's uh, pretty much time to hunt. Oh yeah, almost time to hunt. Can't wait for that. The hubby here got some materials to make a new flushing beam. And I got a new flusher. So I can't wait to use that. Here's one of the places we like to get our raspberries at, as you can see. They're a nice size. And they don't got too many flaws. And, well, you do get a lot of bees here. And all going down this world here is raspberries. And same with the other side. A lot of raspberries, as you can see. And there, lots of raspberries. All up that way too. All over down that way. And we're just grabbing a couple, you know, to just for a little snack. And then we'll be heading home and I'm going to be making up some homemade bread and doing some sewing. Yeah, some raspberries in there. Lots of raspberries. Oh, here we got some army caterpillars. And as you can see, the dogs love to eat the raspberries too, especially this little one right here. Blueberries, raspberries, bunch berries. She loves berries. She's very careful not to eat any berries that she hasn't seen us eat. So that's good. <laughs> 